Hey guys, today we got one that's uh, not the uh, funnest thing to think about or the uh, nicest, but uh, what we have, we've got a little uh, three pound Pomeranian that uh, terrorizes the house and uh, you know she's got to have a place to go. <clears throat> uh, she's been crate trained, she's been uh, potty trained uh, to use pee pads and that's not the uh, funnest thing to always have lying around the house, uh, but and nonetheless that's uh, part of our life and we found a way to Kind of, kind of deal with it as best we can, um, but again, we'll do anything for her, so not a big deal. But a fun little uh, fact that we kind of learned that uh, made it really nice and uh, a lot better <clears throat> for us was that we actually um, laid down a towel first, you know, one of those old beach towels or just an old ta raggedy towel that you had laying around the house. Go ahead and lay that on the bottom. Uh, we found that kind of helps our dog out realize that, you know, maybe it's grass or it's just something firm and it wants them to go to it. Um, but the most important advice that I can give you on the pee pads is don't be cheap. Uh, you really cannot be cheap on these, uh, especially if you uh, expect on having guests over or anything like that. No one wants to see that stuff. So uh, just uh, much like us, uh, try to do your best to keep it clean. And uh, I'll give you a little little tips of advice. Uh, again, we buy the Pet Smart ones. Uh, I think they're called On Spot. I'm not sure exactly more but we buy them in a uh, big big bulk and uh, we just keep them around and constantly keep them changed but uh, nonetheless uh, <clears throat> you know those have uh, the pheromones in there that make the dogs want to actually uh, go constantly go to the spot but uh, here's kind of a little setup we've got uh, of course we got a nice little uh, nook here in our laundry room for her <clears throat> and like I said I went ahead and laid down one of the uh, towels we usually keep a little uh, air freshener down there luckily we got that <clears throat> but uh, you know here's our pee pads uh, they do have some sticks on the bottom if you uh, go on the floor uh, but like i said when once these get a little saturated they really start to get wet underneath here so <clears throat> this is a big reason why we do this to to help protect our floors and to help protect anything underneath it um, that's kind of why we do this uh, as well not only to help them train <clears throat> but uh keep our house uh, as nice as we can so we kind of throw that back in there for her and uh, we've noticed that keeps her uh, you know keeps her constantly over, always on the uh, the towel and everything and uh, <clears throat> If you're like us, you've learned uh, a few of the little gimmicks. Uh, here's our uh, iRobot cleaner. Of course, uh, what this does is creates an invisible wall. So we learned to penetrate, you know, put that in a nice spot so it always keeps it away from it. Because uh, yes, we have had some uh, terrible mis misfortunate events where some uh, some uh, bad stuff got into the wheels that we had to clean out. So we we always keep that there as well. <clears throat> uh, but that's our little spot, and uh, I hope that helps. And uh, yeah, that's just a fun little piece of advice that we've learned uh, and hope that it helps you guys out. Anyway, well, thanks for tuning in, guys, and uh, we'll be back for another one tomorrow. Thanks a lot, guys.